So why does Simon need a loan shark? I mean, didn't he strike oil or something? Apparently, he sank everything he had of that building he's remodeling with Carly. The whole thing was destroyed in the storm. <laughs> the guy never heard of insurance. Look, I don't care if Simon does a crash and burn, but Carly's involved in this, too. Oh, so then you can go and save her. Maybe. What are you waiting for? Jack! Tell Carly I said hi. Hey, Margo, I never said I was going... Hey! Hey! You know, Katie loves me. I know she doesn't have anything to do with Simon. But she's so worried about him wrecking our marriage. It's like an obsession. I need to get him out of town. I, I need to get him out of town. You're the cop. Simon is doing business with known felons. Right, you want to protect Carly. Don't, don't act like you're not worried about him. Like, of course. Of okay, course. Right. And, and, and I think that part of you, you may not say this, but you want your old life back. Okay? You guys love each other. You need to be together. Go tell Carly that. And then lean on Simon and get him out of town. All right, make everybody happy. You're still here. Don't you start on me, too. Oh, yeah, I already started. I was going to finish oh. now. So Carly and Simon are apart. They had a fight. Mm -hmm. She's a little mad at him for now. But what does that mean, really? I, I, I don't know, Jack. You tell me. Yeah, sure, she dodged a bullet. But <laughs> there's always tomorrow. And you know, Carly, she's a trouble magnet. Yeah, you used to love that about her, the way she is, you know, bold, reckless sometimes. She's a good wife for you, Jack. She's a great mom. OK. So okay. are you going to go talk to Carly? Nope. Well, where are you going? Nope. I can't be a good husband. At least I can be a good cop. Simon's got a deal going with this lone shark, right? So? So whatever he's up to, I'll make him stop. <laughs> 